Here on the campus of Walsh University, the Copperheads proved once again they were about as predictable as romantic comedy. Locked in a tie at the end of the fifth, the bats came alive and guess when? The sixth inning. Tyler Jackson's first start made it a dog day afternoon for the Stark County Terriers. The Appalachian State freshman went five and a third innings with two earned runs, five hits, three punch outs and a walk. Amid the excitement of his teammates, the hurler says he changed his grip to be successful and plans to continue that throughout the season. Cameron Flynn's solo shot in the sixth put the Copperheads up by one and Ryan Cowie's run made the score four to two. Flynn battling a nagging hamstring injury describes how he felt. Uh, it felt pretty good. I mean, it, my hamstring still bothered me, but when I take out of the box, but I'm seeing the ball good right now. The bullpen held down the fort once again, giving up one hit and no runs until the bottom of the ninth. The Snakes pulled out a 4-3 win to draw 1-1 one one on their road trip so far. With the win, the Copperheads move up to 7-3 and, and are still first in the Great Lakes Summer Collegiate League.